I haven't been singing for that long. It was, it was more of like a personal thing. I'd sing in the shower, you know, play to myself. Kabilang si Margaret sa mahigit dalawang libong nag-audition sa Star Factor Singing Contest sa Hong Kong. That was my first competition. I don't usually join. I was supposed to join with a friend of mine, pero she had to concentrate on her studies, so she couldn't at the end. In the end, that she encouraged me to audition, so I did it. Nag-iisang anak si Margaret ni na Jose Marie at Therese Ortega. Kapwa nagtatrabaho sa malalaking kumpanya sa Hong Kong ang mag-asawa simula pa noong dekada 90. Doon na lumaki at nagdalaga si Margaret. Sa kabila nooy, hindi nagkukulang ang mag-asawa sa pagmumulat sa anak sa kanyang pagiging Pilipino. Raising a child with the Filipino values in a place that is as cosmopolitan as Hong Kong can be quite tough. And as you know, this new generation is bombarded by media and the access to the internet. So disciplining as well as raising them in the right value system is a challenge for any parent. Um, importante po sa amin kasi ang identity as Filipinas because that is who we are and our DNA is, is that. So, mulat mula sa pagkabata, dinadala po namin siya sa lahat ng activities ng Filipino overseas, primarily composed of domestic helpers as well as activities done by the Philippine consulate. So that she connects, she sees the visual, she hears the music, she tastes the food, she hears the language. And from there, she builds on the foundation of being Filipino, although being raised overseas. And that to me is important because your roots sa pinanggalingan mo ang importante para makatulong ka, makabalik ka, at maka-assimilate ka. Um, nung anim na taong gulang ako, pinawi ako ng nanay ko kasi hindi ako marunong magtagalog. So, sinabi niya sa lahat ng tao sa bahay, huwag mong kausapin pag hindi siya nagtatagalog. So, kahit humingi niyo ng tubig, Nung hindi ko pa alam parang sabihin tubig, yung pahingi ng tubig, please. Um, sa sabi niya, oh, ano? Ano? <laughs> Paki-repeat. So, tapos, natuto na ako. Ngayon, oh, medyo, you know, <laughs> my Tagalog is so bad. Nagpa-practice pa ako, pero it's getting better. <laughs> I just spoke English. Who we got next? Yes. It's Margaret Ortega, who's age 16, and she's going to sing Terrified for us. Hindi inaasahan ni Margaret na makakasama siya sa 24 finalists sa Hong Kong Star Factor. They were very seasoned performers. Sobrang, I was so honestly intimidated. Sa saliw ng kanyang gitara ay umawit si Margaret mula sa kanyang puso. The judges were saying how um, you have three minutes to speak to our hearts. So really, it's about the emotion and the passion behind what you're singing and if you understand it. At doon niya nabighani ang puso ng mga hurado. Itinanghal si Margaret bilang grand winner sa Star Factor English Section 15 to 21 category. Margaret Asiga! And then my friends had to push me forward, and I was still like, what? What am I doing? Tapos, yeah, it didn't really settle in or kick in until a lot later. We weren't expecting miracles. We were just, you know, hoping for the best, but you, you put yourself in the right place and you pray. But this was, a, as I mentioned earlier, a pleasant surprise, a wonderful blessing. Ngayon ay kabilang na si Margaret sa maraming Pilipinong maipagmamalaki natin sa buong mundo. If you have a dream, honestly, just stick to it, work at it, it'll, it'll happen. I hope to be a role model and learn, yeah, I'm Filipino and be proud of it.